I'm Sam Rector for STS on location, and this is... tailgate before Friday's football game had everything. Great music. Great food. That kid. Look at I'm the D. I'm the most important piece of this whole Wildcats spelling thing, all right? I listen, listen, listen here. again. I set up the whole word. I, but we, first we were backwards, and I was like, you know what? I'm literate. I can do this, all right, guys? I can do this. I put this in the right way. That's interesting, because unless Plymouth's mascot is Owilda, I think you guys still have some problems to work out. The tailgate also gave me the opportunity to show off my football skills. Thundersticks. Or maybe not. <laughs> Anyways, on to the game where the Wildcats look to capture bragging rights. However, as this sign alludes to, the Canton Chiefs were about to bring it. Canton got off to a fast start, scoring two touchdowns in the first two minutes, including this 17-yard touchdown run by Adam Pater. The Wildcats answered quickly, driving the ball 65 yards, finishing with this touchdown run by Vic Hicks. However, Canton had a response of their own, picking off this Wildcat pass and scoring two touchdowns. One of the touchdowns was a 45-yard pass from quarterback Kevin Delapaz, with less than a minute to go in the first half, igniting the Canton student section. The Canton Chiefs are up 28 to 7 and a half. Guys, thoughts on your Canton Chiefs thus far? Rachel. I'm really excited. I think it's going to be a great season. She thinks it's going to be a great season. All right, Riley, you're the coach at halftime. What are you telling the Plymouth Wildcats? You're down 7 to 28. Pick it up. During halftime, the large crowds watched performances by the Chiefettes, Saberettes, and the PCP marching band. The second half was more the same, with the Chiefs rushing for three more touchdowns. Kevin Delapaz scored once on this 53-yard run, and Davion Stackhouse scored twice, including this 23-yard scamper to give the Chiefs a 49-7 win. some Canton Chiefs. Guys, uh, you might see some of the Plymouth Wildcats at school, might eat lunch with them. Does this win mean anything more to you? Um, it's a good rivalry, but to us it's really just another game, just another game on the schedule. We're looking for, a, we have big goals set ahead of us, so it's just another game. We had to... All right, another game. All right, what did you guys do to prepare for this game? We had a great week of practice, worked hard every day, we came out here smoking. What is it? It was, a, uh, it was a tough battle up front. Uh, they got a lot of big players, but, I mean, getting lower and stuff, uh, we just practiced harder than they did and came out in the end. All right, thanks, guys. All right, we're here with Coach Beckler. Coach, your defense pretty much shut down Wildcats in one touchdown. What did you do to prepare for that? Well, we just uh, practiced well. Uh, we had a good scheme. Our defensive coaches did a great job implementing it, and, uh, you know, they were scary. They got uh, great athletes over there, and uh, we were worried that we were going to miss some tackles and they were going to slip one for a big run, and... Uh, we contained them well and tackled well and uh, very happy with them. All right, going on to the other side of the ball, what did you like about your team? Uh, our offensive line was very physical tonight and uh, they executed. I can't wait to watch the film and, and, and see what they did. I, it was beautiful. You know? <laughs> all right, game ball, who's it go to? Uh, I don't know. They all, they all get it. <laughs> they all did good. Whole teams, special all right. teams included. All so. right, thank you, Coach. Final score, Canton Chiefs 49. Plymouth Wildcats 7. For STS on location, I'm Sam Rector. Have a great day, everybody.